Did you know an uproar over onions created one of the nation's most famous icons? Listen up. So back in the early 1900s, farmers were furious over being forced to work with price gouging middlemen to sell their produce, and customers were suffering the blow too. By 1907, the price of onions alone had jumped from 10 cents a pound to an entire dollar. That's $33 in today's money. And one city councilman was up for the cause. This is Thomas Ravel, who discovered a never before used ordinance that allowed the city to set aside land for a public market. Seeing an ideal location close to the waterfront where ships and ferries delivered their goods, the city selected this space atop a bluff for the brand new market. On a cloudy Saturday morning in August, a handful of farmers rolled their wagons up the street to sell on opening day. Hundreds descended upon them, eagerly vying for fresh produce. They were cleaned out within minutes. As one farmer described the scene, The next time I come to this place, I'm going to get police protection or put my wagon on stilts. Those society women stormed my wagon, crawled over the wheels, and crowded me off. When I got back, the wagon was swept as clean as a good housewife's parlor, and there in the bushel basket was a quart of silver. Despite the chaos of opening day, it was a huge success for farmers that had struggled to break even. Dozens more followed suit and brought their wagons up to gather and sell along the street. And that, my friends, is how Pike Place Market was born.